Hi there, everyone. It's Marie Vera Lim at Planet Comic Con with Katie George, an amazing cosplayer, one of the many cosplay guests we have this year. And I'm going to be asking her a couple questions about her costumes. Um, to start off, what was your first costume? Uh, my first costume was Haruko from Fully Cooley, and I wore it to an anime convention in Atlanta. That's cool. Uh, how old were you when you did it? I was 16. Wow, that's really impressive. What got you, like, what inspired you to make that costume and do that costume? Uh, I think when I'd gone on the internet one day looking up pictures of Sailor Moon, as an 11-year-old does, um, and in find, looking up photos of Sailor Moon, of course, I came across Sailor Moon cosplay and like a tutorial of a girl who was like, here's how you do your hair in Odongo. And I found her Sailor Moon cosplay photos, and I was like, I want to go to there. <laughs> And, uh, you know, I, I was 12 and I was like, I live in a small town in Alabama. I'm never going to get to cosplay. I'm never going to get to go to a convention. Like, fast forward to when I'm 16 and um, some of my online friends, uh, voice actor friends, are like, hey, let's all go to this convention in Atlanta. And I was like, Atlanta? That's like six hours from here. I can totally do that. And I begged my mom and, and she was like, okay, I guess I'll do it. And she was so nervous because she was like, internet friends, they're all going to come to eat you. Um, and I was like, I have to cosplay. I have to. I've seen photos online. It looks so amazing and like so much fun. And so she and I, like, we went to Goodwill, bought some parts of the costume. She helped me make a my red vest, and then you know I was Haruko. It was it was so much fun. That's really really cool. Um, as far as coming to conventions and being a guest, uh, how does it feel in comparison with you know? Did you uh, did your 16 year old self ever think, oh, someday I'm going to be selling prints and have a booth and be a guest? at conventions someday. Uh, let's go with never. I never would have thought that I would one day like you know be invited as a convention guest uh, for cosplay. I always thought like oh if I ever got become a cosplay guest it'd be because my voice acting career really took off <laughs> which I ended up not pursuing but um, yeah it's, it's kind of it's a little surreal sometimes that that people care enough about fellow like about hobbyists to bring us to conventions to meet other hobbyists but it's it's fun and I feel like we um, you know especially myself with 10 years of cosplay I have a lot of like knowledge that I want to give out that's really cool uh, you said you have 10 years of experience uh, from that do you have any tips for people who are just starting cosplaying or are still not sure about their cosplay career and getting to be bigger and get noticed and that kind of thing um, I mean I think the easiest advice, of course, is if you're scared, like, just do it, you know, like, just go for it, uh, have fun. If I, I, I don't want to say, I think it's hard to have a bad experience in cosplay if you are happy, like, if you feel like you're having fun. But I know it's different for it's different for everyone. And as far as like having good costumes goes, I would say uh, Google it, Google it, Google it, Google it, and then Google it again. Uh, research, research, research. That's the difference between a costume that is you know amazing and a costume that like is all right. It is just basically the amount of like time and energy that you put into thinking about it before you actually started doing it. That's really cool. Thank you so much for talking with us. This is Katie George, and I'm Marie Virlin for Sci-Fi for Me TV here at Planet Comic Con.